What is up guys, welcome back to the channel guys We here back with Melody Festivalen Part 2 of the Hall of Fame uh, Now the fire so I didn't know part 1 was live from 20 something to 30 something Or maybe 15 to 30 something But now I think we have like the top 12 that are going to be on the list for the Hall of Fame So like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think Is it is it accurate? Or not, you know, I didn't look at the comments or anything, but that's gonna be interesting to see. So, but let's jump into this. Y'all hit that subscribe button. Not too loud. Okay, Sana Nielsen participated seven times. My goodness. Okay. She averaged at least fourth place. Got eighth right there. Do you shot the Okay. Oh. She got a nice voice. She can sing. Over almost two million votes in this competition. Oh, got a nice haircut and everything. Nice, nice. Oh, she won. Okay. I don't think. Let me see if I looked and seen if she. Okay, so when it, uh, she got second, fourth, and she won 2014. Nice. Okay. 1984. My goodness. All the way to Lada. All the way from 84 to 2012. My goodness. She did it seven times throughout that time. Average place. Okay, got third right there. Juliet and Jonathan. Okay, came with her sisters out here. A lot of Ingberg. Don't let me down. Okay. Shirty Clamp. Well, that name sounds familiar. got seventh right there or second right there 2003 to 2022 oh she participated this last season that's why that's why the name sound familiar she participated this last season i might have heard one of her songs i might have eighth and heat one okay Oh, he came with a group this time. Okay, Shirley. Burning alive, that would be horrible. Be a horrible feeling right there. Yup. That's her. Dang, I didn't know she was there that long. Since 2003, the first time. Yeah, I knew, knew the name sound familiar. I heard that song. So, that's pretty cool. Andres Johnson, sing for me. 2006 and 2019. Okay. He didn't win, uh, but he's a legend. Okay, Andres. I guess the people that always come back to this, they're real serious about music, I would say. Because, uh, I mean, most of them, y'all got to let me know because I've seen the part one and this is part two of the Hall of Fame. Are they still doing music or was it just for the festival, you know, for the competition or, you know, are these, are they still doing it? That's the question. Are they still producing music out here for the people. Army of Us. Okay. Army of Us. Oh, 59. God dang. That's a long time. <laughs> Houston wanna bring one in 1960. Second. He can sing now. At least for that time, you know, that's how the music sounded. Rollen ska drivas, rollen ska drivas, allting ska drivas, allting ska drivas. Lulululul. 
Oh, we went deep on that one. <laughs> Lulu Leo. Okay. He won it twice. I see you. No. Nineteen sixty-eight. Got shaken. Okay, got a little dance move. Dang. I know some of y'all. Know some of y'all born in the fifties, sixties, seventies. It might be, you know, he might be a legend for y'all. Who is this? Linda. Linda Ben. Bing ting, bing zing. Can't pronounce it. Oh. Okay. You got seven. She didn't get no wins, though. She got energy, though. She bring the energy, though. Look. She brings some good energy. Look. <laughs> The energizer. Or in oh, she got a haircut now. Yeah, one thing I can say about it, she brought she bring the energy every song. Oh, it's not. Twenty twenty. Oh, she came back twenty twenty two. Did I see this song? I might have. I might have. Jessica Anderson, two thousand three winner. Right off the jump one. Sixth place. She must have won like two or three times. She got 13% winning. Kalanita. Okay. She got a lot of votes too. Okay. She got, she got better. Her voice got stronger. Got the gold, everything. Party voice. Sound like a good one. Horizon. I think I've seen this one. Dang, she glowing though. Oh, 86. Nan Grimball. Okay. I might have seen them since they won. Nah, I don't think I heard that one. We got the icicles back there. Whoa, what was this theme? You see her ears? Interesting ears. <laughs> oh yeah, she like cosplay out here. Different. <laughs> like a Halloween type of song. Okay. Man, I got sick. Oh, 2020. I need to see Melody Festival in 2020. Like, I know Eurovision got canceled, but it don't look like this. This was canceled, so I need to check this out. Maybe they was able to do it before it got canceled 2020, so I need to check that out. Magnus Carlson. Got second. He participated eight times. I think I've seen that one. Dang, out of 15 times he performed eight. Okay, kind of put on some weight right there. Okay. I'm guessing the next top three. Andrews Lillard. Oh, they got a second. A seventh right there. Oh, he was a part of the same group. 
<laughs> Tiffany just showed the same song. Oh, no, it's ever that one. I guess he came by himself. Okay, the two girls on that song were made it. They made it to the Hall of Fame, too. Okay. I like that suit jacket. Oh, yeah. So all of them are legends and Hall of Famers out here. Here we go. Kiki Davidson. Hey, she been there 10 times. Okay, see here with groups and stuff. Mission Mickey Mills. John Morgan. Okay. Oh yeah, I know this one. Yeah, okay. That one made it to Eurovision too, I believe. Oh, she won at 85 too? She got 20% winning. So. She can sing though. Okay, I think one of the other women made it to the Hall of Fame too. At least for video purposes, Hall of Fame. Okay. She came back in 2018. Osby, Tennessee. Nice, nice. And Luce Hansen. Oh, she came 13. Wow, definitely gonna definitely can't wait to see what she looked like from '63 and she came in 2019. That's crazy. We got she in black and white. They got the black and white videos popping for her. Okay. 13, 14 times for participation. That's crazy. Dang it, this 69 right here. Oh, that was her. I know this group. Lady Antoinette. Okay. In, in the main. Nah. He's sleeping on the stage? Okay. Oh, she part of this group. Okay. She came in 2019. She can still sing. Dang, she still got a nice voice. Man, from 63 and she's still singing. Out here 2019. That's good. That was good. So Anne Anne gets the number one slot for 13 times and she's still out here. She can still sing. That's good. That is good. But nah. This was good. Got to see some artists that I've never seen. Then there's a few of them that I have seen. You know, just from the last video and from the Eurovision throughout the years video. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Got a great artist. That's why I like this competition because this is a tough competition, especially after seeing this year, 2023. I'm like, the top three contestants could have made it. Maybe the top five in 2023. They could have. I ain't even going to lie to y'all. But this was good. I hope y'all enjoyed it because I enjoyed it, man. But y'all let me know how accurate or do y'all believe it's accurate with this Hall of Fame list now. You know, I know we have some that made it and won Eurovision and stuff like that. But all in all, we just talking about Melody Festival. You know, the legends that come and keep participating, participating and giving some good music. You know, whether they win Eurovision or not, whether they win a competition or not, they're coming back giving you songs to remember. That's what it's all about. But I enjoyed this. Hope y'all did as well. They got a top 30 song with the most votes in Melody Festival. So I'm going to have to check that one out next. It's, it's very interesting, very interesting. But that's all I have. Hit that subscribe button. Y'all be blessed. Be the best and be you. I'm out.